nothing up. I told you not to come around here anymore. Is that you again? I, I, I'm sorry, sir. I, I'm just trying to make a little money. Well, you just need to get out of here, okay? Really, sir. I, I I haven't had anything to eat in two days. Look, I don't want any trouble. There's expensive cars all over the place, right? Their owners find out. I let you stay a little bit furious. Don't, no problem, sir. They, they, there would be no problem with the cars. I, really, I, I'm an honest man. I, I'm trying to make an honest living. Okay, but you got to promise me you won't make any mess. No problem. There's not going to be any mess. Everything's going to be absolutely fine. Okay. I actually think I might have a job for you. Really? I oh, think so. That that would be great. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Uh, by the way, my name is Kyle. It's nice to meet you. Uh, yes, yeah, thank nice you. To meet thank you. you very much. Right. Thank you very much, sir. Yeah, yeah I do hope no so. No problem. No okay. problem. All right. Well, okay. Let's just let's just go and put you to work. Okay? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's yeah. Do it. Just cleaning up here, ma'am. Really? Since when are homeless people allowed in this parking lot? Uh, I'm the new janitor here. D don't worry, I'm not gonna touch your car. Certainly you will not do that. It worth more than your life. Oh, no. We don't need to be rude. I'm a human being, just like you. Listen here, Bob. You're not like me. You cannot afford this car. You cannot even afford to take a shower. So do me a favor, get out of here. Listen, young lady, just because you have money doesn't mean you can treat me like dirt. Are you arguing with me? You're a scum. How dare you raise your voice to me? I'm going to find a manager. This world has gone completely crazy. I'd like to see her go through half the stuff that I've been through. <sighs> there he is. He's snooping around my car. Who let you in here? Get him out of here. Or should I tell everything to my husband? Answer me, Bam, who let you in here? I'm just doing my job. Listen, people like you don't belong here. Go back to your box now. Don't show yourself ever here again. Do you understand me? I'm just cleaning up. Jesus, Derek, where are you? Derek, get in here now. You are a piece of garbage. You don't belong here. Respectable people, they pay their price to get their back in here. So they do not see people like you. Do you understand me? Derek, come here. Yes, Mr. Craig. Please tell me, what's going on? Are you kidding me? Uh, what do you mean? What do you mean, sir? What I mean? I mean this. Do you want to, to lose your job or what do I, what he's doing here? I just, I just hired him to do a little clean up here, that's all. You have 10 seconds right now to get rid of him, or otherwise you'll end up your days together with him under the bridge. Do you understand me? Clear, absolutely, sir. So do it now. I'll be right back. Okay, we'll be off. Let's go, buddy. Let's go. We're going to get out here. Miss, I'm terribly sorry for what had happened. And this will never happen again, I promise. And don't let any more homeless people in the parking lot. I'm watching you. Hey, I'm sorry that it turned out that way. Uh, I didn't mean for it to happen. Some people can be so rude. Um, you know, forget about it. It's just the tip of the iceberg. You know, he could fire me. <laughs> yeah, I've worked with people like that. They have no idea what it's like to be poor. So how did you, how did you end up in a straight? <sighs> yeah. I used to work for a bank, deciding who should and who should not get the loan. This one guy came in. He wanted a loan to import illegal materials into the States. Then I found out that the bank owner was in on it. So I wouldn't give him the loan. They fired me. I lost my job, so my wife took my daughter and left. Then I had to sell the house to pay the debts. 
So I lost my job, my wife, my house, all because I wouldn't give up on my principles. Jesus, man. Gosh, I feel for you. Thanks. I feel for you. So oh, here, take this. Go ahead, take this. Just, just, just Are go you ahead. Sure? Absolutely, you're serving. Oh, yeah. That's all I can wow. do. Wow, thank you. Thank you very much. You gotta mention that. You know, if, if Mr. Gray finds out that you're still here and I let you stay. Oh, he'll, oh yeah. He'll, he'll fire me. Yeah, 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 no problem, I'm, I'm going. So, um, you no know, worries. I wish I could change it. Thank you, thank you. That's all I could do. Hey, no worries. You take care of yourself. Thanks. I'll see you around. Some help. What's going on? Uh, one homeless guy took our phone and ran off. Right. Can we use your phone, please? I right, sure. Just for one call. That's fine. Keep Thank it. you. Go ahead. Uh, do you remember his number? Hey! Hey, stop here! Come on! Actually, it was it was Kyle who did all the work. Who? Uh, the Kyle, the the guy you you fired today. If it wasn't for him, the the car would have been ruined. So I think you should thank him. Hey, Kyle. I owe you an apology for the way I treated and talked to you this afternoon. Uh, I, I think you did the right thing. I'm not sure about it. Anyway, I would like to thank you, and this is for you. Yeah, you don't have to do that. No, no, I think I have to. Please take it and open it. Oh, thank you. You know, I thought that we could walk together. Wow. Are you in? Oh, yes. Wow. Uh, th thank you. Huh. You're absolutely welcome. And uh, you can start whenever you want to. And also, I will try to find a place for you to live. Wow. Thank you. I won't let you down, sir. No, no. I won't let you down, my friend. 